Hey guys, in today's video, I will be sharing a thrift haul. Yes, please. If you missed it, I will link my previous thrift haul in the description box below. You should definitely check it out. I found lots of good stuff and you just never know what you're going to find when you are thrifting. So let's go ahead and jump into today's video with one of my favorite finds and it is a little apple teapot. I think that this little teapot is just so stinking cute. I had to pick it up. I absolutely love apples and for the past few years now I have been picking up little pieces here and there to like grow my like little apple decor collection. Last year, which if you're new, I do have a sweet precious baby girl. She's a toddler. Miss Olivia Kate. She is just the apple of my eye. I love her so much and we did or I put together a little apple photo shoot absolutely oh I thought it was so cute and Hallmark did too because they did showcase it on their channel as well y'all I'm just obsessed with apples and I had to pick this up for my growing collection I love teapots and teacups I collect them as well and then it was an apple and I just absolutely had to this one this little teapot was $3.99 and it is perfect there's no chips it looks great so I am so excited about that little find next up we have some mugs I've actually had these mugs for a little bit this haul is a little bit collective sometimes you know I go out and I only find one little piece like in the case here I had only found this little apple teapot when I went thrifting that day and I'm just like putting everything together in one haul so I have these two mugs here. This one, y'all, it's so adorable. I picked up a little s'mores mug similar to this at Walmart last year. I think the only difference was maybe he wasn't sitting on like a little uh, graham cracker and like Hershey bar. That little mug is absolutely adorable. But when I saw this one and I only paid 99 cents for it, Yes, please. It had to come home with me for my hot cocoa bar. It is so stinking cute. And then this one here I thought was just so pretty, especially for winter. A lot of my Christmas mugs are red and green and they're bright and they're vibrant. And then this one is just like very soft and neutral. It does have like a little winter scene down here at the bottom. I loved the little shape. It was 99 cents, so adding this one to the collection as well. The next little find is absolutely adorable, and it is this little um, Avon honey jar. How adorable is it? The little lid has the little golden bee on it. It doesn't really look used whatsoever. It has the little spoon. So cute. This was only a dollar as well, so I had to pick it up. It would look darling in a tiered tray at a coffee bar in your kitchen on a shelf. So I had to pick it up for only a buck. Okay, next up I have two items here. One is the little basket. I thought that this basket was just super cute. Uh, I think I took the price tag off of this. I'm pretty sure this basket was either three or four bucks. And then I did pick up these candles. These are moon candles and they were 99 cents. And I picked up, I have four here and I have two over there. So I have six of them. And they are in, I believe, two different sizes. So you couldn't beat the price for these. Okay, and next up we have something for Miss Olivia, brand new in the box. This little camp out set was only $2. It comes with 11 pieces. It comes with a duffel bag, a lantern, a roasting fork, hot dog, marshmallow, two graham crackers, a chocolate bar, two logs, and a pretend flame. This is just too, too cute. I haven't looked it up, but it is by Learning Resources. I can guarantee you it is definitely more than $2 retail price. This was just, it was too good to pass up. Okay, I'm going to move a few things out of the way because I do have a box here filled with goodies. Let's go ahead and dig into this box. I have three of these hats here and they're actually 
planters. They are decor pieces. I have three of them. So here's one. I believe they all look the same. Yes, they do look the same. They are these adorable little hats. I love the light pink absolutely perfection with the little flowers so they're planters you can hang them up these would be super cute in a nursery a baby girl's room a playroom you can fill them or stuff them with like a baby's breath that would be adorable very cute for a tea party my mom actually flipped them over in the store and they can stand up and that is what sold me. Flip them over, have them standing up as a centerpiece for a baby shower, a little girl's tea party, just a tea party in general for brunch. I am all about decorating. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope that you'll stay a little while. I'm Bianca and I love to party plan. So whenever I'm out thrifting, I'm definitely outsourcing and looking for items that are unique and that I can add to some of the decor that I have here at my house or to add to my party planning decor. So I thought that these were just ugh, perfection. I love that they're versatile, that you can stand them up have some cute little floral pieces or arrangements next to it or you could hang them up and I do have three of them. Now they were three for five dollars. You literally cannot beat those kind of prices at the thrift store. Three hats, only five dollars. Yes, please. Okay, speaking of party planning, again, I'm always looking for new pieces to add to things that I already have. So I saw these little football themed food picks, brand new in the box. They were only a dollar. You can put them on a cheese tray, a veggie tray, a fruit tray, a little grazing board. You can like pop these into like the top of a burger. It just adds instant decor. It makes things super festive and I am here for all of those things. Next up, I have this little salsa jar. My mom found this and I thought it was just absolutely adorable. I think it's so stinking cute. It was only $1.99 and I will be adding this to my fiesta party planning tub. How adorable is this? It's so cute. Look at the little peppers. It's adorable. Which if you've been watching my vlogs, I just posted our little like the party planning prep. I was prepping decor pieces, centerpieces, and the backdrop for a recent fiesta we had over at my cousin's house. I'll have the link to that video in the description box below if you'd like to check it out. But make sure you are subscribed and turn on that notification bell so that you will be alerted when the next video goes up for that whole little party planning to be able to see how the party came together. Next up, I have a really fun piece. My mom found this little planter for me. I believe it was a couple of bucks. It was actually brand new with tags on it. I thought it was so cute to put a couple of plants in it and have it sitting out on the patio. If I painted this white, it would make it look just so bright and fresh, which I may go ahead and do that, but I do love this like green that it's in. Okay guys, I'm not sure what happened to the footage of these next Next few items so just bear with me for this little angle for the next few items so I found this Whole Foods market cooler new with the tags ripped the tag off but I picked it up for $7.99 it's brand new I actually took the packaging off of it it's the perfect little cooler to go to the park to have a picnic take it to the beach to the water park I was thinking about taking this even to go into the grocery stores or when we go to Trader Joe's. I can put my cold items in here so that they stay cool on the way home. For eight bucks, you cannot beat this little cooler brand new. I think it's adorable. It's supposed to have like that brown paper bag look. So stinking cute. And then inside of it, I did store some of my haul items. So next up we have these little snowmen. They are absolutely adorable. The pink is what sold me. These are going to look so cute in Olivia's room for Christmas time. I will jazz them up a little bit like maybe the little hats need 
like a little snowflake on them. And this little snowman set was only $2.99. Are they not the cutest? Okay, and the last item in this portion of the haul is this book here. Meg actually found this book for me. It was $1.99. It is in great condition. So pretty. Bad girls throughout history. I'm so excited to add this one to my book collection. Okay, next up, we have entered the last portion of the video, which is going to be a little book haul. I am a bookworm, and Miss Olivia Kate is also a bookworm. I picked her up three books here recently at the thrift store. One of them was Dear Zoo. Oh, so cute. She actually has it with her in the playroom right now but I was able to sneak these out. And we have Smiley Shark and Clickety Crab. Super cute books, and they were only a dollar each. You have to love those thrift store prices. And then I do have a stack of books for myself, and they all were a dollar. A dollar each. My sister actually picked all of these books up for me and y'all I am so excited about them. So I'm adding these to my collection. We have To Have and To Hold by Jane Green. We also have Family Pictures. We also have Girl Friday by Jane Green as well as The Sunshine Sisters. Y'all for a dollar do not hesitate to just pop into one of your local thrift stores and definitely check out their book aisle. Okay, the last two books I have have really cute covers. I absolutely love a pretty cover, but they do sound like they're going to be really good reads as well. We have this one by Jody Thomas, and it is the Little Tea Shop on Main. I'll read you a little blurb on the back. It says, a rainy day ritual, a tea party between three little girls becomes the framework of not only their friendship, but their lives. The Little Tea Shop on Main is a beautiful love letter to the power of female friendship, and when you read it, you will feel like you have come home. Last but not least, we have the reading group by Elizabeth Noble. I am so excited about all of my new books here. Alrighty, that is going to be a wrap for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my little thrift haul. If you did enjoy this video, if you like thrift and hauls, definitely give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out. Thank you so, so much for spending a little bit of your time with me today. I truly appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave and hit that notification bell so that you won't miss my next upload. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.